going. I'm going to press first of all the uh, arm when it came in uh, again the cartridge dislocated from the arm uh, the wires are broken we've uh, registered that uh, this was due to the way in which the things were packed uh, here's a recording of it right here you could see it now I'm going to press the record player we have no way of telling if the sound works or not because the cartridge is disconnected from the arm going to press the um, manual uh, automatic reject or play button and let's see what happens with this and I'll show you that the record does reject it goes to a certain point and then what it does it does not play the record fully even without the cartridge it should go to the end of the base and reject which it does not without even touching it if it stays on this spot it indicates that it's stuck here that was not due to shipping it was part of the problem to begin with the record play was sent out that way I've contacted a retro auto tech person he's willing to come to the house uh, and it's sixty five dollars to look at the machine and it goes toward the fee toward repair if if you want the machine sent back I will send it back but because of improper shipping and because of the way this record player was playing you'll have to pay the return fee and I will wrap it well and whatever that costs you'll have to be part of the refund policy okay <clears throat> I'm gonna email you to the following and send you that same message the video as you can see now I will stop it and again show you because I am not gonna force the arm that's where it will play to whether the cartridge is in or not the other thing that I noticed here which you did not indicate in the sale that this cartridge was jury rigged with a piece of wood and put in there that was never indicated to me when you were selling the item you said it works and plays great and <clears throat> you'll enjoy the 78's so I just want to point it out I'm now going to stop this